my deltoid. Regardless of the type of shoulder pain that you're having, whether it's impingement or you think it's deltoid, which it isn't, or likely isn't, labrum, biceps tendonitis, whatever it is, the cause of most types of shoulder pain, and you're special in your own way, but your shoulder pain really isn't. We've seen it a million times. An impingement occurs in the shoulder and it causes pain right through here. Bicep, labrum, pain usually occurs in here. And the reason why is because your shoulder blade is in <laughs> improper position before, during, and after any exercise and movement that you're doing. Let's show you an example. So Andrew, his shoulder blade is shrugged completely up like this, all right? And I'll do that with a model here and too. And it's rolled forward. And it's rolled forward. So there it is, it's rolled upwards. Now, when the arm is lifted, if you can go out to the side a little bit, Andrew, because that would be lateral, because this model doesn't want to turn into much. Notice here what occurs at the blade. You can see how, hold it there, Andrew, for a second. Um, right here, this is your supraspinatus, one of your rotator cuff muscles, the most commonly injured. See how it's pinned between this bone and this bone, it's wedged in there. Along in this groove as well, you have your bicep tendon that goes through here as well, your labrum, all the things are in there. But now watch this, okay? As the shoulder position sets, it scoops, it pulls down and it scoops under, boom. See how much more freedom is in there? Now there's more freedom for the arm to move. So the, the goal isn't to get more shoulder flexibility, it's really to learn to control and strengthen your scapula, your shoulder blade, and to position it properly. When it's positioned properly, you'll be able to move better and your body's actually gonna be able to heal. Your body cannot heal if your shoulder blade is up in the air, grinded like this. You can get all the shots and pills and surgeries you want. It will never heal properly because it's out of alignment, it's out of position. So one more time, okay? Your shoulder blade likely, most types of shoulder pain, it's shrugged upwards and it's rolled forward. And when the arm lifts, it doesn't go anywhere. You see it's not going anywhere, it gets, it gets the, the upper bone here gets wedged right in there and it tears things in there. It doesn't matter what it tears, the solution is still the same. And the solution is pulling that blade, scooping that blade down under a position, which will allow your arm to come up higher. Okay? So that is how to improve your shoulder range of motion, how to improve your posture, how to eliminate pain, and stop how, to, how to balance the shoulder development of the, mus the musculature in your shoulders, how to do all the things you want. Oh,